All right, new at six tonight, embattled LA City Council member Kevin DeLeon addressed the council for the first time today in months. He argued against his imposed censure and what that means for his power. Because what is next, if you will, if it is eight members subjectively, if you don't like what you're doing, what I would say, colleagues, is beyond the political considerations of today's vote, is that this is a real slippery slope. Daily on referring to an item that passed today, 12 to 2, that will look at potential consequences the council can impose on a censured member like him, including limiting access to discretionary funds and restricting participation in council committees. Now, De Leon spoke for about eight minutes and spent those minutes defending his record, but did not mention the leaked conversation that ignited this city hall scandal in the first place. He also didn't offer any apologies. De Leon said limiting his power only hurts his constituents in District 14. This is a potential overt attempt to injure a council member at the expense of directly injuring his voters. This is not representative democracy, colleagues. Now, during his speech, most of his fellow council members stood as a form of protest. Councilwoman Monica Rodriguez is the only one who expressed concerns about the motion approved today. I mentioned a 12-2 to 2 vote. Those nay votes were Rodriguez and De Leon.